God damn it, man. I hate seeing this shit. Of course, you know. You shouldn't have went to Georgia. You wanted to go race car, right? Right now, I'll just take the heads to pack so we have those. I don't got the money to fix that motor right now. Guys, head on over to www.swangang.com. Order up your merch. Huh? <laughs> tell them to order up the merch. Help us pay for this motor. I can tell you, I ain't got the money for it. Keep liking, sharing, subscribing to the channel. Hit the bell notification. Hit the bell notification. We got a lot of good things coming. Hopefully no more blowed up motors. Because, you know, we weren't lying to y'all. You know, we, did, we brought the storm. The swan storm. Right here. This is proof. Brian jinxed us. Oh, I didn't jinx it. That fat foot over here is jinxed it. If Brian was there, he would have told me to get out of it. Yeah, sure. I would have tried to. Well, I just told you right off the red, red light, other lane. But he, even at that case, you would have went out the next round, buddy. You would have never noticed that thing out of phase like that, you know? Well, Dad would have checked it when we came back in. Glad we didn't. He uh, he told us not to tear it down at the track. Just trying to take that head off. It's been all bad. Hey, B. Yes, sir. Back to the pit, jumped out of the car. So let's pull the engine. Let's pull the heads off. I'm like, yeah, you fucking minder. I didn't think you know how much damage done that motor. Hell, no, we ain't pulling that thing apart. Hey, where you lucky you need to go in? Tyler don't let me drive the side by side. He don't let me do nothing. He don't take care of nothing. I take care of the car. Yeah, it's almost like mama's. You blew Blow it up. I'll fucking take care of it. Yeah, on your ass. Slinky, whose side are you on? I don't know anymore. So now that we got the rocker stands off, go ahead and knock off these head bolts. Hopefully this side comes off a little bit easier than the last side. If you have to pull out a grinder or a sawzall, that's, That's probably not good. Door, I knew when he called back, I knew they were saying, yep, we'll, we'll, we'll do it at 60. They changed that tune real fast. Oh, this thing got a 15 foot garage. Nice. I can't wait till he lets me use it. That bitch ain't gonna let me use it. Shit. <laughs> In reality, if he wants his own property, he just pull that bitch over here and run power up to it. He can live in his own crib right there. Mom ain't allowing that. She's gonna be right over there. What's going on in here? Yep. I wonder if this has got body paint. That's the only thing I would. It looks like it does. Some of them have and some don't, but I think because it's a higher end, yeah, I think it's going to have body yeah. to be painted. Yeah, uh, it's mine. Mine, mine. 18 cubic foot for sure. They weren't letting Tyler, they weren't letting Tyler uh, go off the property. No. Nope. Oh, hell no. Especially when he offered them a good deal. Yeah, but how's he going to get it here? What do you mean? Look, I'm going to put it right on that fucking truck. There's a fifth wheel hitch in well, there. I gotta go get it. The fifth wheel hitch is up at home side. But yeah, I got the hitch to ride. I took that head off. It's too bad for me to lift it and put it on the truck. Yeah, I can't get it. Well, I could probably get it if I'm going to get a full group. But I got the bear hug in my Where'd Brianna go? Her boyfriend's? Uh -huh. I started being about that shit yesterday. I totally agree with you, boss. Uh, uh, 110%. I, I, I had a talk with Brianna, and I told her, I mean, she, she's cool. She didn't have a no problem. I told her, you know, I don't mind. I don't mind if you want to get the fuck out of here. I don't mind if you want to get the fuck out of here. I don't mind if you want to get the fuck out of here. I mean, the thing is, dude, I'm just not having bumping and grinding in my house. I mean, you know, no bumping and grinding up there. And I told her, you know, if she was my daughter, it would That definitely wouldn't that happen. Don't be allowed. Fuck no. You gonna let Christina have people over? I know. Like, if we were gone, 
for the weekend or whatever. Yeah, she could and you never, didn't even like that. Did I you? didn't even like that, but yeah, she could, you know, just because I knew, it, I felt a little better because she wasn't there by herself. But while I was fucking home, oh, fuck no. No yeah, fucking man. dudes in her fucking bedroom. It's just different, now, man. Her you know boy, I gotta say, her boyfriend, you know, got fucked hey. up one night. Hey, I don't have that. Homeboy fucking rolls right up the stairs and goes in there and sleeps in the room. Brand, he ain't sleeping down on the couch. Oh, no. Home, homeboy got fucked up one night, her little boyfriend. He slept on the fucking couch. And then I was up all goddamn night making sure it wasn't no fucking creep. Hey, you got the morning, morning bed. Get the shit and get out. Oh, Go. yeah, yeah, get out. All right, give me that 516. So yeah, so Mo lays all pissed hey, off. Hey, you two channel gonna love my family. <laughs> oh, you're still recording. <laughs> oh yeah, all time. We got a dysfunctional family. It is what it is. We got it rolling. I'm glad I got the new. I got the new Hero Eights. I got the 256 gigabyte card, so we hey, can look, go ahead and video all we want. Look, so I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna put it on. I didn't know you had your shit rolling. But here's the thing. They can see me now. We're gonna have a little one on one. So here's what I got going on. My wife's little sister lives here at the house with us, and she got a little girl. And you know, she done been through half a dozen boyfriends since she's been here probably about four years. Well, now she got a little lover boy coming over here, and you know, they I ain't never letting no, no men stay at my house. And you know, when we're gone for the weekend or whatever, my old lady started letting lover boy stay up in the house. He said no bump and grinding. <laughs> and I told Brandon that too. I know what's going on. You know, I'm not stupid. I was that age too, but here's the thing. You know, now lover boy's up in the house all the time, you know what I mean? I mean, it ain't like he's standing on the couch or nothing. He just goes on up and I mean, dude, I just gotta kind of move out of his way. You know what I mean? He just makes his way right to the house there. Goes in there and gets I'm a just, bowl of cereal. I'm just not good. Yeah. I'm just not good with it, man. It is what it is. I mean, at the end of the day, you know, Justin and Tyler, they're my sons. But, you know, Brandon's not my daughter, even though I treat her like my daughter, but I just don't like it. It is what it is, man. I ain't gonna change my weight. Now my old lady's all mad at me, and she can go ahead and stay mad, because I give zero fucks whether she's mad at me or not. Hey, I don't like it. Hey, she's so mad, she didn't even say fucking one word to me. There's only one motherfucker that's running around the house in his fucking tea bags, and that's me. Yeah. Oh, shit, I don't want to see that. Simple as that. I don't want to see that. I don't want no... I mean, bro, I done had Justin and Tyler tell me, they went up one of them other little hoos running around there and had Brianna bent over the fucking pool table up there. So, oh. you know, and I shoot pool on that thing. So, you know what I'm saying, man? Like, I don't need to know about all that. So, the best thing to do is not have any of that going on and we don't have that problem. I don't have that problem. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad you're here, B, though. I'm not wrong, am I? No, sir. Uh, I, I agree with you 110% on that. Oh, but I'm the biggest asshole in the world. Hey, I, I, I gotta give you an example too. Like with my wife before I was even married to her, you know, I, I spent the night at her place a couple times, but I had to sleep on the couch. Then, uh, I, me my, and a couple of my buddies got kicked out of an apartment, so her parents let me move in over there. I wasn't allowed to stay in my old lady's room. Yeah, hell no. I mean, I guess it'd be, you know, if he's down there sleeping on the couch, it'd be one thing. That way I can hear him creeping up the stairs if he's trying to go upstairs oh, yeah. and not you know, go up there and fucking be bumping and grinding, you know? Oh, but, yeah. dude, he's right on up for sleeping in the bedroom. Oh, you know? no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't do that. You ain't fucking fuck up that, boy. What's going on, B? Why don't you? We already got enough problems. Try to, like, pick, move ahead a little bit. See if I can get up underneath this. There it is. Well, don't don't damage any of that. Why well, the, the back's not coming off? Dude. Oh, you're gonna have to go back and do the same thing again. Is that one welded too? Oh yeah. That, that aluminum on that firewall is good in nah, That came well. right up, buddy. You be able to pop that right Let's up. Have to get underneath it and do it. Guarantee it's welded by that same same deal. Nah, it's stuck up front up there now. It's all the way at the bottom. You just get in there and wiggle it. Yeah. Where's your pry bar at? The little one. I'd just rather him do all that bumping and grinding over at his grandma's house. Where's the one Grandma right? ain't paying attention. <laughs> Me? I'm paying attention. Hey, Grandma might even like it. I'd be laying there sleeping. I'd be laying there sleeping and I hear some noise. I'll hey, wake up and be like, And the room's right above there. The room's right above my room, B. Oh, <laughs> uh, you're, you're here. Dude, any noise, I'm not liking it. Yeah. 
Is that what it sounds like? I don't know what it sounds like. I mean, I ain't really hear no sound like that. B. Try this front side. I bet, I bet not hear no sound like that, but it's just, man. Little yeah. bit of bump and grind. I just know that they up yeah, at they up at bump and fuck. Hey, let, let's, That's all there's to it. We need to go get us a purple, uh, you know, infrared light and go up there and look ah, for your DNA no. up there. Hell no. Not stuck up front up here, though, buddy. You have to get under it. Well, you shouldn't have to get there. I mean, up there ain't gonna be the problem. It's just probably up against that head. You just, I mean, up against the uh, plate. motor plate. There you, go. you just gotta grab it and pull it up. I'm trying. It's not letting me. Keep pulling on it, dude. It's it's up against that. Yeah, let me get that little pry bar. Get up on. Get that. underneath the bottom of it. Just be careful what you're doing. You don't groove up the head or nothing like that, man. Let the big cojone over there. He, he fucking puts some muscle behind it. it. Looks like it's up against the motor plate. That's what I'm thinking. I mean, we've taken the heads off in this yeah, car. Yeah. No, we ain't never had this motor part. Yeah, we haven't. Oh, uh, no, not not in the car, have we? Yeah, we have. No. One time in Georgia. This car? Yeah. We had, to put, we had to put rings in it. I ain't never took a part, motor apart at a track. We never had to. Uh, uh, yeah, man. Maybe I'm thinking of the other car. The white car. I never took this thing apart. Right there. That's what it is. It's right up against that deal. There you go. It's off now. God damn, I think they're fancy. Yeah. It's still up against it. Can't hold chassis moves. Yeah, that's what they do. It's in a bind somewhere. Nah, that, that head bolt's melt, melted. Yeah. It came out there. Yeah, I see it torched right yeah. there. Do what you were just doing. I just get this thing. Well, I had it up further than what I got. No, it, I it's coming, but it, it's torched on that head bolt. It did the opposite sides. It's coming. There you go. Oh, sir. I'm out of gas, man. Don't let it slide back down, that's all I can tell you. It's torched there too bad. Right at that fucking head bolt. So it blew the head gas and it got water in there. Yeah. It's fucking same deal, it's fucking torched. Keep working it, you're almost there. Damn, Justin. Just couldn't get the foot out of it, could you? But hey, I know, like I said, you had money on the line. Listen, that 2800 bucks didn't mean shit. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Go ahead, buddy. Ah, there you go. You're almost there, you got it. Oh, that hurt like a fish. Oh, that fucking hurt. Oh, girl! I smashed my finger on that fucking thing. Pry on it and he pulled it. The pry was gone. Oh yeah, she fucking melted that motherfucker. Same thing. Not as bad, but it's the same. You wanna reuse these? No. Hey, there, there's our new giveaway, signed head gaskets. This guy wanted to pull the heads off so we could it, it got the front and the yeah. back. It got the front and it's the like, back. Let's pull the heads off. <laughs> it, Dude. Got, it got the front yeah. and, yeah. Here's a bit. Let's pull the heads off. It got the front and the back. Yeah. It, fucking dumbass. Look at it. Fucking did. It, it fucked all those pistons Hopefully up. they can weld those holes back up. They got to re-drill them holes out of them out. Hopefully, but you better hope they can't. This block ain't junk. I can tell you that right now. That's $25,000. Why would they junk the block? Spill it. Do whatever the hell they want to do with it. Yeah. They might sell yeah. the same stuff, but they go resell it once they pick it up. 
That's the point of being built. Oh, buddy, that's bad. I told you it was going to be bad. Well, guys, head on over to www.swangang.com. Pick up all your merchandise. Help us pay for this motor. We pay for it together. Got 18,800 subscribers. If everybody gives a dollar, we can pay for this motor. <laughs> hey, uh, donate. It, it came out on both sides, boss. Oh, Jesus takes the wheel. Look, you know, see, see where it even melted no, the oil line. From underneath your foot, the Slink, shut the fuck up. Hi guys, so we're gonna go ahead and end this vlog out for today. We got both heads off. Uh, does not look pretty. No, it's very pretty. <laughs> kind of looks like Brian on a daily basis. It's very pretty. So uh, it's gonna be a lot. <laughs> pretty ugly. We're gonna we're gonna go ahead and uh, clean shop up. We still hey, gotta get a transmission converter. Little reenactment. Little reenactment. Here, here we go. Little reenactment. I wouldn't step on the car like that. It might yeah, flip the car. I'm up. trying to get my old leg up in there, buddy. Whoa. Oh, I can't get not on that jack. I can't yeah. get on it. Yeah. Dumbass jacks. <laughs> <laughs> but guys, y'all keep on liking, sharing, subscribe to this channel. Uh, we're only going to get better. I know we've had a couple bad luck races here lately. A uh, couple bad luck races, man. I feel like we're, every race. Two dry shafts, transmission, a motor. We're, we're just... A car. Yeah. Hey, we're shitting 2020 all up. That's what we're doing. Hopefully we have a better outing at our first race in Tucson, Arizona, March 20th. First race of the Street Outlaw No Prep King Season 4. Hey. We're going to bring Slinky on to a race with us. He's a huge fan of Caleb Morton. Yeah. Oh, I, 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 Dad. Hey. He's a huge fan of Caleb. Caleb will kick his ass. Yeah. <laughs> I, I like Caleb too, boy. You going to ride around Caleb? Rock Caleb. This is one of my favorite people on the show. He's big fans of Kayla and Boosted. Uh, he ain't even a big fan yeah, of ours, big. good girl, Slinky. I mean, real down to earth, you know, real cool chick, man. We're going to get out of here. Subscribe. Next video, we're going to be pulling the transmission converter out of the car. We have to get this crank, the cam, everything out of here, get it all cleaned up, because we do got to send it up to uh, Mr. Pat Musi and uh, have his guys go through, fix the block. Fix the heads, get everything welded up. Hey, Pat, man, we need some help, buddy. Like 911, we need some help. 